scientific notation. Scientific notation is used to write larger numbers in a shorter form. And the form is a times 10 to the n, where a is a number that is greater than or equal to 1, but it's less than 10. And n is the number of times we must move the decimal and in which direction. Let's take this number, 230,400,000. It's a pretty big number. We can write this in scientific notation by taking our decimal, which is at the end of our number, and moving it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 places to the left so that our number is now 2 and 304 thousandths. And you see my A is a number between 1 and 10. 2 and 304 thousandths is greater than or equal to 1, but less than 10. Times 10 to the 8th. And this number is the same as my original number. We can also use scientific notation to take very large decimal numbers and write them in a shorter form. We do the same thing. Our A has to be greater than or equal to 1 and less than 10, which means we need to move our decimal 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 places to the right so that it becomes 2 and 304 thousandths times 10 to the negative 5. And that negative exponent lets you know that that's a very, very small number. It's a decimal. It's less than 1. Whereas a positive exponent tells you that it's a very large number. We can use these exponents to compare our numbers very quickly and easily. Looking at these two numbers in scientific notation, I can tell that 1 and 51 hundredths times 10 to the fifth is the larger number because it has the larger exponent. So it's a great method for very large and very small numbers. If you need a study guide, click the book at the bottom of the page. If you want more free test videos, subscribe to us on YouTube. If you just want to keep watching, click the next video.